Hello. Hello. I see the garden is already full. <laughs> Hi, Ragnall, how you doing? You having a good week so far? Is hoping. Uh, right. Let's get everything set up because things are slightly different with this setup. Um, do do do. Right, that should be ready now. It's Brock run. We need Brock. Good point. Very good point. Uh, yeah. Welcome to Bloodborne Broccoli Run. Um, if you don't know what that means, uh, I I I guess you do now. That's the simplest explanation I could possibly give. Um, yeah. So this is uh, Ludburn, but with Brock. So, <laughs> this is a thing that you can do in Bloodborne. Oh, it's been a while since I played this. Um, in fact, it's been two years since I played this. I last played this on stream when I played the DLC for the first time. And we ended the run with me putting on the Milkweed rune and showing off what the broccoli setup is. Uh, and it's still equipped, so... <laughs> We're just carrying on that run. I think we finished the game and then just immediately sort of... I think we went in and does, did some Chalice Dungeon stuff to end and then that's it. So we are we are on New Game Plus. Uh, we got this from the end of the DLC so that I can actually use it. Um, yeah, this is a combination of a couple of things. A combination of a, a rune called the Milkweed Rune, which gives me a weird head, uh, and a weapon here uh, called the Cos Parasite. Uh, when the carcass of Koss washed up on the coast, its insides were teeming with tiny parasites, unlike any found in humans. This typical weapon can only be- oh, this atypical weapon- can only be clasped tight and swung, but a Koss parasite is said to stimulate phantasms inhabiting a lumen wood. Now, normally this is a quite boring weapon, but if you have the milkweed rune attached, uh, you- fun funky stuff happens. Yeah, so that's my- uh, that's my attack for this this playthrough. I have no idea how this is going to go. I've never used this. Also, we got I, I love the, the roll. <laughs> and the dodge back as well. Um, it's a good time. It's fun. Um, hi, Dark. How you doing? Welcome to Brock. Um, we... Yeah, so this is still... I believe my character is Arsnips. Yep. <laughs> That's what, what I named myself. Brock has no spine. <laughs> Um, yeah. Now, th there is a problem with this. Uh, partially the problem is that I've done most of the Chalice Dungeons on this playthrough, which means I have quite a lot of levels. Um, and you might think, brilliant, lots of levels, that's great. Um, however, <laughs> uh, one thing you can see about my levels is, if I have a look at it down here, can I... Oh, oh apparently that's what we look like. <laughs> Forgot about that. <laughs> sure. Um... Can I... Uh, ah, no, go away. Um, yes, down here, th these are our stats. So vitality, endurance, strength, skill, blood tinge, arcane. Now the last four are all to do with how strong you can make certain weapons. Um, we evidently went largely into strength with a bit of skill. Uh, not much blood tinge, which is ranged weaponry, and very little arcane, which is uh, magical weapons. Um, alas, <laughs> the cost parasite is entirely arcane. Um, which means we are doing currently 40 damage. Um, this is not upgraded. I'll have a look and see whether or not I can upgrade it. But, uh, hello! Had to move your internet and you think it worked? <gasps> Ooh, fingers crossed. Hey, Christy, how you doing? Welcome to Broccoli. It's Broccoli Town. Ooh. Um, yeah. You made an unkillable warrior in Wildermyth. Oh no, you've broken the game already. <laughs> uh, okay, how, uh, I don't have any, oh, I have 700 souls apparently um can i do i have what i need to upgrade this because this is new game plus which means that everything is slightly more difficult um i have done new game plus i think new game i think i've done all the new game pluses um yeah yeah because I, I did a new game plus six by three uh okay cool i have a lot of okay we can upgrade that's good that's a plus it's not it's not a huge upgrade it must be said <laughs> um but at least i can put gems in it uh, they have eight armor and can shout at people to gain two, so you've gotten twelve, so... <laughs> Miss! Dark's breaking the game again! Um, I need... Do I have any souls? So, not souls, echoes they are in this game. I've not played this game for two years, just as a reminder. I have vermin, apparently. Quite a lot of... 
I have 96 insight and all of this. Another 80 spare. Like I said, you have to be prepared for a lot of things for Broccoli, and yet less than a week later, hello Broccoli. This is literally the file that we played two years ago. I've done nothing in this file. <laughs> we just happened to end that playthrough, starting a new game with Broccoli. So, I didn't have to do anything, it's great. <laughs> Normally, you'd have to complete the game all the way through, well, all the way through to the end of the DLC. Um, so yeah, we, we skipped that, which is nice. Also, they have a big sword. Always nice. Right. Uh, let's try and uh, rid this. We'll be trying to use this as much as we physically can. Uh, oh, just enough chunks. And a rock. Oh, well, I'll be using this, so I might as well. Fully upgraded. Wonderful. Um, can I need, I need blood gems. Give me... Get rid of everything from this. How do I... Okay. Because we were using the saw cleaver. There's something in a tonitrus. We don't need that. I'm using the tentacles. Give me the tentacles. I think that's everything. Okay, what can we do to this? So currently we have 93 damage, which is better than 40. Um, but what do I have that can increase arcane attack? <laughs> not a lot. I have some things that can add physical, but that's not much, is it? Um, ooh, okay, there's something there. Get that to plus 40. That's just attack up. Might be helpful. We can add physical to this, which might we might have to do at least early on. I don't know what I'm doing. I haven't used this, but I don't. I've never done an arcane build, <laughs> so this is news to me. That's pretty good. Stick that on, just see how that goes. Um, that's about as good as I'm gonna get, I think. Um, here, can add a little bit of fire. Uh, that's plus sixty. The weapon durability down minus sixty. Oh, that's not very nice, is it? Um. We just add 42 bolts. That's pretty good. <laughs> sure. That's better than the arcane damage we're doing. Um, we don't have much, do we? <laughs> we really don't have much. Just, just stick that on. We'll go arcane and then we'll see how it goes. Um, we might have to do some some fiddling around with uh, min-maxing bits and bobs. Oh, 78. Again, we have to, we just have no stats for this weapon. That's a net positive, I think. <laughs> Can I respec in this or am I stuck? I'm stuck. Um, I think I'm gonna go with this. I'm just gonna see how it goes. We we're still basically early in the game. Um, yeah, we'll just we'll deal with it. Welcome home. What is it you desire? Uh, is, the game might be a bit quiet, I can sort that. Um... Can I sort that? <laughs> I guess I'll have to do it in the game. Um... Very well. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, we need 100,000 souls to level up once. Yeah. Um... We'll see what we can do. Also, I have a whole bunch of insight. I might as well spend that on something. Uh... We have... I guess we have... That's not a thing. Require anything that's going to be useful for me. I don't think I can apply paper to the thing. Uh, are we going to just get upgrade materials? That's fine. Uh, spoilers, I guess, for Bloodborne, by the way. <laughs> we can get some cool clothes. Uh, that's about it, really. I mean, this frenzy is just going to be a problem anyway. Or this, this inside is going to be a problem, so I might as well just buy everything. Give me all your wares, good sir. I have 80 spare. Let's go. Bonash set. Nice. Well, that got rid of about half. Um, no, that's not the menu button. Oh, that's going to be a problem. Uh, <laughs> oh, I already had the Bonash set. And the Gascoin one. Uh, there's no point putting on a hat, really, is there? <laughs> not going to be able to see it. I'm broccoli. Uh, should we go Madman? Let's go full, full tentacle. Um. There we are. 
Full tentacle build. Nice. Badman set seems apt, yes. Um, okay, well let's let's just see how this goes. I have not played this game for two years. I'm not entirely sure I played a Soulsborne game last year, so this is going to be interesting. Um, we did apparently make our way to this bonfire, but that's it. Lantern, not bonfire. <laughs> Do I have to Souls jar myself during a Bloodborne playthrough? <laughs> anyway, how's everybody's week getting on? I played Hellpoint. I did play Hellpoint, that is true. Um... Yeah. It's been a while, though. Online use only. That's a shame. I don't have PS Plus. Yeah, we haven't even unlocked that shortcut. Good, we haven't done anything. Um, cool. Also Remnant. That, that has guns. That's different. That doesn't play the same. Uh, I have maximum pebblage. Okay, you. You're going to be my test. Come here. Uh, that's not awful damage, all things considered. Two hits. I can deal with that for the moment. It'll get worse as the game goes on, obviously, but we'll try and do what we can to mitigate that. Hello, sir. Oh, oh okay, that's a very slow RT. Oh, man. Yeah. This is not a sl fast weapon. Asterisk looks at gun in hand, asterisk sure. You can't do... You, well, you can do damage with this. Oh, yeah, we should try the cannon glitch. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Oh, God, no. <laughs> no, no. I need to learn how to play again. This does not have as much reach as I thought it did. Oh, dear. <laughs> a really bad day and happy to be friends. Oh, yay. Well, not yay for the bad day, but yay to be with friends. Tentacles! Oh yeah, I need to turn the game up. We need to hear those lovely tentacle sounds. Away! You plague ridden rat! You are not wanted here! His turn's finished! It's taking more than two hits now. <laughs> Already. Do I have like a jump attack? Oh, nice! <laughs> oh, that is amazing. <laughs> Headbutt with the broccoli. <laughs> I did not know that. <laughs> okay, let's turn this sound up. <laughs> Maybe you should get good. Yeah. <laughs> Goes back to rotating furniture. Nice. Um, hi, miss. How you doing? Hi, enjoy, enjoy furnitures. Let's turn this up. Dad, sound effects, voices are always good. How you doing? You having a good day? Welcome to Brock. Blue. Blue. How am I doing? How dare you? Um, I'm doing alright. I am Broccoli. Welcome to Broccoli. Oh, oh yeah. I never used this. There's a lantern just up there. Um, and I'm not fighting you. Waiting for PCR results. PCR is... thingy. <laughs> High chemical romance. Um, there's an enemy here, isn't it? Must have come down. Molotov cocktail. Hello. Have you heard of the good word of Cthulhu? That. Ah. second dog. That may be all I have to offer. <laughs> You got a book potato, I saw that one. I hate it. Whoa. 404. Error, tentacle not found. People's COVID Republic. <laughs> that sounds like an awful place. Uh, it's a test uh, you get when you've either tested positive on a lateral flow test or have been in contact with folks who have. Ah, okay. Waiting to see if you have COVID or not. Well, fingers crossed. Finger, it's weird to, yeah, fingers crossed you fail the test. <laughs> Not really quite the, uh, in the spirit of it, but, uh, hi. I'm getting used to the game again, it's been a while. Okay, I can kill those in two, but not most of them. Yeah, here's hoping you die, that's, that's the best way to put it. 
how? Wow, this is so slow. I, I, my first playthrough of this was with the threaded cane. I'm used to this being a fast game. Oh, I, I cannot hold it down. I forgot about that. Headbutt. Oh, the headbutt's good. Headbutt's good. Um, the co worker got the boosted and then caught COVID a few days later. But that's it. Uh, yeah. I'm bad at the game! Leave me be. That's not. Unfortunately, headbutt is quite tricky to do. Ah. <laughs> headbutt! This is quite slow and wibbly wobbly to respond. This is. <laughs> it's definitely gonna take some getting used to. It doesn't have terrible reach, though, so that's it. To deal with it. We might mess around with some other arcane stuff while we're here, like augers and such. Uh, don't know how it is in other places, but uh, it's also the test you get if you really have to know if you have COVID or not as a quick test. It's debatable. Yes, they're uh, not extraordinarily uh, accurate, but uh, accurate enough for large-scale use, I guess. Hi. <laughs> you know what? I'm just going to leave you. I probably don't need to pick anything up. Um, <laughs> let's do the classic Bloodborne run. Scream, scream. Ow. That's a, that's a hefty old gun you got there. Yes, I hope your uh, hope your friend's okay. Or your work, co-op worker. Uh, screw it, let's go this way. I'm not here for a long time. I'm here for a good time. I know where I'm going. Uh, let me know about sound. Obviously, this is a different setup because it's PlayStation. What are you talking about? Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. You dare insult the Brock? Can you smell what the Brock is noodling? Yeah, this is a slow combo. I think this is a one hit and run thing, which is not good, given that I have terrible damage. Uh, that's not down, so I'm going to have to go through the sewers. Um, I don't think I need to pick anything up, so we can just sort of... <laughs> very slow. <laughs> ah, this is an end carrot! Hello. Um, there's the book one again. They came back. They came book. Uh, should we try Cleric Beast? This is gonna go bad. <laughs> Excuse me. Ah, oh, Sackler. Excuse me. All right, let's give this a shot. I don't remember this fight at all. Hi. Good music there. Oh, look at that lovely damage. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, I can knock out quickly with this. Screw you. I do slightly more damage with my head. I just realised that was a bad idea. Oh, I have no rally. It's just not ideal. Swishy swish. Okay. Try to dodge into that. That's fine. So we're very slow indeed. Oh yes. We can work something out. Oh, hi. There's a grab apparently. Shame. Thank you. I guess I could... Yeah, I can't use fire paper. Okay, I don't have one of them equipped. I tried to dodge.
Okay, we'll work this out. So just the weapon or the NG plus. It's, we, we, we have no arcane scale. So... <laughs> On the plus side, this is the beginning of the game, so, uh, blood vials. Real cheap. <laughs> yeah, I've really got to learn my timings on this one. And then work out how to get damage. Because <laughs> this is insane happening. <laughs> What's her face though? I don't think so. Oh, I, I have something interesting to show off with her, actually. <laughs> Let me get that. If we get that. <laughs> There's some fun glitches that have been discovered in this game since I last played it. <laughs> Uh, the biggest one I have is 10,000 echoes. I need 100,000 to level. Just checked? No. I'm learning how to play the game. Nice. Glitches in Bloodborne? It's fine. Screw you and your broken I dodge. Somehow, didn't get it by that. Oh yeah, that's his uh, little tantrum swipe thing. That's not really safe to uh, run into an attack for. It, yeah, it's basically one hit with this thing, isn't it? Or at least in phase two. Need to learn the fight. I only fought this once. <laughs> Missed it on my first playthrough. Hear the music though, which is great. I think it's frankly uh, significantly problematic that one of the best pieces of music in the game is the first part. <laughs> the VA for this boss would have been paid well, yeah. The Corey Taylor. <laughs> him doing some screams with Dr. Lucas. At least I'm only getting hit by the little. Ah, nice. How much is this going to do? Probably not a lot. Oh, okay. That's, that's not terrible. Yep, that's all that coming. <laughs> At least I got a stagger. That's something. I was far away from it. Who do you feel? It's my job. Oh, 
actually done pretty good damage with the gun, all things considered. I'm just gonna keep doing this, I'm doing good damage! Play with your food. I thought. <laughs> now my broccoli went away. Well, it's worth a try. Um. Okay, let's see how we can get better damage. Also, maybe turn the music down just a tad. <clears throat> Uh, what you mean is you saying Remnant isn't a Souls-like because of guns? The problem with Souls-like as a term... I don't I don't hate it, and a lot of people who really don't like the term Souls-like, I'm fine with it. I kind of know what it's going on with. But the problem is, is that Dark Souls is not defined by a mechanic. Um, in fact, it doesn't really do anything new, all things considered. It just did a lot of things together really, really well. Um, and... As a consequence, calling something a Souls-like is just like, oh, it needs to do a lot of things together really, really well. <laughs> it's like very vague. <laughs> does it have to do all the things that this game does well? Probably not. Um, okay, so let's let's see what we can do with gems, please. Uh, let's try and move away from Arcane until we have some level in it. Um, can we get any good... F there was a good physical attack that just sort of added 30, 40 or whatever to the thing. 24? Oop, 38. The getting rid of this will get rid of 9 arcane, but if we can add more to physical... Mm, not really. Just don't have good gems, really. That's the problem. Plus 44. I lose too much arcane to make that worthwhile. Oh, oh, here we are. 62. Ah! Hello, Kiro! Welcome. We're having we're having troubles, <laughs> but it's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, can I do anything with runes? With beast stuff, doesn't really look like it, does it? Yeah, this is also defensive stuff. Or oh, echoes. 
Don't really need a lot of stamina right now. Might be worth getting more echoes. Nah. There's a plan. Hello. Hello and welcome to. I. This is. I'm. This game's hard. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Let's let's pop like most of our big stuff. Um. And just see whether we can get a level. <laughs> uh. I think we can't. That's twenty thousand. Hmm. And blood rocks, uh, just an upgrade material? Yes. Blood rock is just, uh, upgrade weapon to max. Yeah, that's uh, arguably a waste. <laughs> because I can't, yeah, level up anywhere near with that. First thing to be specking is making weapons better, yeah. And my weapon is fully upgraded, so we're gonna have to do something clever. Um And you may very well ask, what what is clever? I'm still working on that. Um we can get that. <laughs> Just skip a boss. Maybe we have to try and find some certain gems in Chalice Dungeon. Watch the Bloodborne speedrun recently? It was, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna see if I can work out how to do the cannon glitch before uh, next stream. Nothing like it boosts arcane damage or anything like that, does it? Might have been easier to start from scratch. Almost certainly, but we had this file here. Um. Also, if I wanted to do a run that sort of started from scratch with an arcane build, I don't know what you would use to start with that. If only your PS4 wouldn't threaten to go nuclear every time you start. <laughs> um, that's not ideal, is it? Not ideal. Uh, also, if you wanted to start one from scratch, I'd have to play basically the entire game before I got broccoli. And that feels disingenuous. We're just, we're just gonna work this out. We'll work it out. Let's just skip um, Cleric for a bit. Um, and we'll see what we can do. Uh, arguably Gascoigne could be easier with reposts, so... Going back to the year... Uh, go back to the help. Can't speak. Going back to work for the year now? No. Well, I hope, I hope it's at least, uh, not abrasive. <laughs> AGDQ should be starting soon. It is soon, yes. Um, I'm sure there'll be a Bloodborne run in there now that they've found the cannon glitch. Smash, smash. Love to change to AGDQ. Excuse me, pups. Excuse me. Yeah, we really don't need to pick anything up. So. Oh. Come on, Eileen. Oh. A hunter, are you? And an outsider. What a mess you've been caught up in. And tonight of all nights. Here. To welcome the new hunter. Prepare you. yourself for the worst. There are no humans left. They're all flesh hungry beasts now. Lovely. Still lingering about. Yes. What's wrong? A hunter unnerved by a few beasts. No matter. Without fear in our hearts, we're little different from the beasts themselves. Hunters torch scales with our game. <laughs> it's fine. We can sort it out. We just pump every single little bit of stuff we can possibly get into leveling with arcane when we can. Um. 
Also, in things that were kind of wild, you were tuning into a couple of streams in the world first race for the new Final Fantasy XIV raids. Then you went to sleep. They're still going right now. Commitment. You looked at those beasts. So spooky. You could find the Hunter's Torch really early, so it could be an option. <clears throat> Thing is, doing that involves two playthroughs. <laughs> like, do people want me to do two playthroughs? The first playthrough won't involve broccoli at all, so it'll be a lie. Damn. That was uncalled for. Excuse me. Thank you. Friendship. Uh. Yeah, yeah. This isn't Dark Souls 2. I can just fall, and it's fine. Excuse me? Hello, Biggie. How are you doing, you're up. Uh, fun fact, I didn't want to come here. <laughs> but I'm here now. Broccoli run part one. The road to Broccoli. <clears throat> Should we do that? Maybe I'll do it off stream. <laughs> I don't know. Do a couple of streams of this. And then maybe I'll come back to it. <laughs> do a do a real quick playthrough in the week. <laughs> to get an arcane build. Because this damage is not good. The trap. So what was that? Ooh. Oh, this is so bad damage. <laughs> no, God. Excuse me. Variety streaming is so 2021. This is the year of the Bloodborne stream. <laughs> yeah, okay, what we'll do, we'll do this stream. See how it goes. I reckon with Viscerals, a lot of this could be mitigated. Um, and yeah, if things go sour, I will do off stream or next stream. We'll start a uh, a fresh playthrough and work out how to do an arcane build before we get broccoli. Look at them canines. He's bald under that hat, you know? <clears throat> Hi. Not good with repostes. Oh, come on. Not doing much damage. think about this track when I think about this soundtrack because I always I really like this track it's a good track but it just doesn't feel like Bloodborne to me at all <laughs> feels like it should be in like a war film or something Pure arcane people do seem to go with Hunter's Torch. Right? 
Like I say, if, if I'm really hurting for stuff, I'll mess around with like the order of every artist and stuff like that. Assuming I've got it. I think I should. I'll beat. It's just annoying. <laughs> Just a gentle slam, it's fine. I never really learned Gasper, I never sort of panicked him. <laughs> See, this isn't terrible. So if we get some Molotovs up in here, it'll be fine. Yeah, I'll put that idea. Trading a lot of damage. Oh, come on. I was gonna Brock slap you. Bump! <laughs> I love the headbutt. I've got a lot of defense. Like, that's our, that's our main sort of saving grace here. Got a lot of rally. So slow. I was going to do a beast play for it. It was it was between beast and broccoli for this, um, but I thought broccoli was funny, so <laughs> now I regret it. <laughs> beast is at least fast. <laughs> Rock slap. Rock slap. Boom. <laughs> Sometimes I have a lot of reach, sometimes I just don't. There's no chance doing viscerals with this, it's all backstabs. It's just far too slow. <laughs> Spell of Brock! It sings to me. Just slowly chipping away at my health. As I am slowly chipping away at his, I guess. Seems fair. Okay, I can kind of stun lock it, it seems. That's something. Oops. Wasn't even paying attention then. Oh, you, I thought you were doing the fast spell. Well, that's still the difference between those two. That's not a slow chip, that's a lot of damage. Chip off the old Brock. Ah! That's not a lot. I can't even do a <laughs> charged R2 there. <laughs> Ideas or have plans? They don't largely involve turning the uh, sound effects down slightly.
Rip, indeed. Hmm. Should we do? Should we do a fresh playthrough to get the, the problem with the problem with doing the fresh playthrough, right? Is I'm gonna have to defeat the orphan at cause <laughs> to get the weapon. So I've got to do at least decent damage. <laughs> Even before I get this, I don't know. I'm trying to work things out. Let's let's have some experiments. Um, don't need these at the moment. Hmm. We may even come back to this later when I have done an off-screen playthrough. Uh, cursed brew can't use that. Uh, executioner's gloves. See, this is what I'm thinking. We've got stuff like this. We can, like, mess around with some some additional bits and bobs. Empty Phantasm Shell. This is all arcane stuff, so I feel fine using it. Black Sky Eye. I've never used any of the Orc of Ebrius, just can't use Call Beyond. That's a lot of stuff that we can mess around with, instead of using a gun. <laughs> Which is the dangerous part, not using a gun, but uh, we'll see, see what we can do. Don't want the monocular. Excuse me. I would test to see what they are, but I can't just rest at the bonfire and get my stuff back. Clever, thank you. Uh. Back to the bridge. I don't even get echoes for that. It's unfair. Hello, Danny Gascoigne. How you doing? Get up here, get me echoes, and then see what we can do. Let's have a bit of a mess around. Hi. Ah, oh, I missed the harvest. That's terrible. Can't use the empty phantasm shell, apparently. That's also terrible. Oh, yeah, that's terrible, isn't it? Also terrible. I'll keep using the glass. Uh, the gun. Now I know I can kind of stun them. Too bad. around these things, you know? Excuse me, sir, have you considered just sort of not? <laughs> the wiggly makes a shot from shoot you up close, yeah. Wiggly wiggly! You can't beat the limbo. Okay, you can't beat the limbo. Yeah, okay. I, I have to use the stagger to my advantage, it seems, but it's a technique. It does seem to be working to a certain extent. Let me interrupt that, it's quite nice. R1 spam! Screw you! Oh, 
ran out of stamina. Not that we did a follow up. Though. My gun got unequipped, that's what's going on. <laughs> what happened there? Okay. <laughs> Dr. Wildspinning gets angry, yeah. Turns out it's rather difficult to shoot something when you're just punching it instead. <laughs> we'll get there. This is my objective for the stream, beat Gascoigne. <laughs> we can do that at the very least. Possibly at the very most. Uh, actually, no, I just realised I was going to say. Um, I was going to say, actually, if we're doing Arcane, then maybe the Hunter's Torch wouldn't be so bad for this fight, because this last phase doesn't like fire. So the whole point of this is that I'm using the tentacles. Um, just look to the AGDQ schedule and there'll be a Dark Souls all-boss race and blindfolded any percent Sekiro run. <laughs> he didn't say any Bloodborne. Nah, that's fine. The, the Bloodborne skip was very new, so it probably came out. Or was was discovered after sort of applications and such. Um, I think I'm alright with what I've got, to be honest. Um, it's just a matter of getting get good, you know? Get good. I don't think there's anything I can really do to help, other than go to Chalice Dungeons and try and find better, better things. Um, cool. I mean, this is a broccoli run. I didn't say it was a broccoli and tentacles run, did I? <laughs> uh, also, didn't say it was not a Molotov run. So the problem is, I'm in a dichotomy, right? Because me, as a person, as an individual, would be perfectly happy just carrying on like this. But me, as a person who understands that people don't want to watch someone doing the same thing over and over again on stream, <laughs> thinks, maybe I should just start a new playthrough. <laughs> the word over the spirit. <laughs> How dare you. <laughs> I've done more ridiculous and difficult runs than this in Souls games before. This is not. This is nothing new for me. It's just whether or not it's worthwhile doing it on stream. Because this is just going to get harder as the game progresses. It's not a matter of like, oh, things will scale appropriately. It's like, I do not have levels. I'm not going to get levels, really, all things considered. And the way the scaling works in these games is that things later in the game get harder more than things earlier in the game. Somebody find the name of King History Convergence a few hours. He's very tough in that mod, and that's very low. He was very low. Not a lot of I can do once I've started attacking. I have to just sort of keep going. 
in the hope that he's not doing something I can't stop. So we find if it wasn't such a slow attack. I think that's the thing that's really getting me. Is that this attack is not fast. I, I did, like, the equivalent of an entire stream fighting uh, Nameless King on my first attempt at doing that. Back in the good old days of Dilapidated Bridge. Do I actually have my gun equipped? I do, that's good. Screw you. Oh, come on. I will, I, two perfect parries and not one repulse. Fuck that one. Well, I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> Just blank. Sorry. Battling Pooch's poor old brain making them go back at uh Arctic go out every ten minutes. Oh. It was interesting to see how people find a different boss difficult, you never found him that tough. Honestly. Oh yeah, oh no, you're talking about the nameless game. Um that wasn't so bad. It's annoying that you have to keep fighting the first phase each time. Which is the problem I had with Frieda as well. Um I thought you meant Gascoigne. I was going to say, honestly, on my first playthrough, Gascoigne wasn't that difficult at all. He was my first boss. I was like, oh, okay, I'll get used to it. Bloodstuff Beast, on the other hand, was a pain in the ass. <laughs> and now it's basically trivial because you can just sort of walk to the left. Ooh, nice. Uh, oh, we almost have enough for a level. Yeah, I know what I needed to do there. It's just a matter of doing it, you know? We don't have to do Bloodstuff Beast because I've got the old Hunter Emblem. Uh, I think we can get a level up, my friend. If you want to hear dialogue of characters, uh, you can go back and watch my original playthrough, which I think is on YouTube. Uh, so this would be Amelia. I just got given this, so let's use it. Welcome, what is... Give me one arcane, please. Three more damage. It's better than nothing. I don't even know if this is a good weapon, even if you have arcane, you know? I don't think the physical damage is doing anything for us, really. Um, I think it's a bit of a compromise. Uh, so it might be better off going back into proper arcane. Ah! 
the Gascoigne parson it. <laughs> That's the weapon durability one, yeah. As long as I keep an eye on that, keep repairing, be fine. I won't, obviously. I'll come to a boss that takes five hours to kill and then four and a half hours in, I'll need to repair. No reason. Uh, cool. But yeah, it's just the kind of thing that you're sort of... Kind of patterns you're used to in terms of bosses that are difficult, bosses that are easy. Stuff like that. Like, I, I personally found Sekiro to be the easiest of all of the FromSoft games. Um, and part of, me, part of me thought that that was down to the fact that it was the last one I played, which is the newest one, um, which means that I'm used to these sorts of games. But then I've heard other people say that, you know, they, they've loved the Soul series and Sekiro is the, by far the hardest one they've ever played. So I think it's just a matter of what, what bits of the play through, what bits of the things, combat, movement, all that sort of stuff you find easy, what bits are comfortable for you, what bits aren't. I have the emblem. I bought it. Uh, is it worth... Thanks. Uh, no, it's not actually, is it? Again, I keep thinking we're doing... We have an arcane build. No, we don't. That's the problem. Uh... <laughs> I was going to say, maybe it's worth using the Rose Marinus or the Flame Sprayer or something. It's like, they are good if you have the things to use them. Uh, no, you have to go around. It's been a while since I've done that. Uh, Brain Sucker! Excuse me, excuse me, thank you very much. I'm going up the lady. Curse it, beast! This turn's finished! I love how this is sort of very... <clears throat> sort of gothic Victorian London, and yet everybody in the game sounds like they're from the east end of sort of slum town. <laughs> Working down on the docks, isn't it? Four hits to kill a dog, are you serious? Well, let's see how immediate it is. At least I know where I'm going. Did I summon someone? I have insight, there's no reason not to, I guess, Henriette. Yes, I have insight, I know. <laughs> I didn't realise they homed. <laughs> so there, yeah, they do. Oh wait, Amelia has a heal. Ah, oh, that's gonna be a pwn. Looking up scaling the tentacles just kinda suck. Great. <clears throat> Is it too late to turn this into a beast playthrough? <laughs> I'm sure if you can get the right runes made. Do not engender passivity. That's ah, too bright. Screw him again. Go okay, well with our cane, but that's where all the damage comes from. Well, that's literally all they scale with. <laughs> so I'm, I'm glad they scale with that. That was not a dodge, apparently that was a jump. Be cool with beasts. I wanted to do a broccoli playthrough. I'm annoyed. I don't even know. What are the beasts scale? I imagine beasthood is a thing, but... Uh, 
Uh, do I even have them? Should yes, I do. Here we are. Dead. <laughs> D D. I mean, unupgraded, they do better. <laughs> they do more damage than I currently do. <laughs> well, not not really. Well, almost. Beast like broccoli too. Beast needs their veggies. Yeah. Okay, this is gonna go terribly because Amelia heals. I like I like jumping into a boss fight. Oh, okay. It's further in than I thought. Kinda. Tentacles have a scaling, so that's something. <clears throat> yeah, that's this is the main problem is levels, right? So maybe off screen grinding for levels in Chalice Dungeons? Not an impossibility. It it'll be painful, but it'll be possible. <laughs> <clears throat> get all the eye runes. Get the uh, thing where killing something with a visceral gives you like quadruple souls. Th that's another glitch that was found. Is if you stack the uh, Melee is not going to well. If you stack all of the visceral runes and you kill two of the um, living failures and trigger the f within like seven seconds of each other with a visceral and end the fight with the second one you end up getting I think it's something like 80 million souls <laughs> yeah see that's not good yeah. but I didn't forget about that I just thought it'd be a little 29 damage! We get to hear this song again though, that's something. The scram! Positioning yourself. I mean, I guess you're big, so it makes sense. She's screaming! I, I normally just out damage this one. So actually knowing how to do this problem is tricky. Hello, Tate. You've done no damage. Oh, come on. The rule we're busting this. It's just me, or is that a weapon? Is that just a game? That's close. The beast you just need the beast call and the beast's embrace rule. Uh, where did you get that? Hello, fuck it. This is this is making me want to do Beyond the Fog Gate Yard Edition. I found it hard trying to write that one. 
Because in, in like Dark Souls games, the bosses are just like, eh, whatever. But in Bloodborne, they're like so tied to the world, they feel like they actually belong in the world. <laughs> Dark Souls is just like, oh, what fun fantasy bosses can we come up with? But with Bloodborne, it feels like there's a story with characters. Uh, defeat Lauren. Okay, so we do have. We need to finish this in a month so that we can play the D-Make. Well, if you look, <laughs> I have less than half of my heals left, and she has significantly more than half of her health. Fire! That, even that didn't Business step. I, I could. I, the thing is, I could be just really careful and only attack when I'm absolutely certain I will not get hit, and I'll be fine, right? There's nothing wrong with that. But do you get a black hole? That feels appropriate for the future war. <laughs> Does an amygdala put that in there? Um. But the problem is, the problem with doing that, which I would, again, is usually how I do these sorts of challenge runs, just very, very carefully, um, is just that kind of little one tap and out sort of thing, very careful. But this box heals, and you can't really stop them, unless you out-damage the heal. <laughs> which is not my favourite mechanic, it must be said. There's a lost cause, by the way. I'm not gonna go. Next the question. Because I, th I think Amelia is definitely going to be our, our gatekeeper for this. At least this part. Of the shadows. Hey, look! We've finally broken limb. Now you're going to heal. <laughs> oh, broken up. So the limb mechanic in this game is very rarely explained. Isn't it explained? Um, but it's pretty cool, I think. Uh, if, you, if you break a limb of an enemy, you do more damage when attacking that limb, and they have to take time to heal it. Um, so you get a chance to attack, so on and so forth. Um, get more damage, justified consistency. That's that's her healing one of her limbs. Ooh, crap. Scrims is drowning me out! I forgot to turn everything down. Sorry! Uh, well. This seems implausible. And I don't think it's going to be fun to watch. So. Oh, I missed it. What was that? Let's try and work out how to make an arcane build. Screw it, I haven't played this game for two years. Let's do two playthroughs. <laughs> Did you kill me? Oh, no, no, I was going to die. Um, you get it. Oh. Oh, yes, pale blood. Uh. What's this? Uh, 
Uh, young, milk toast, whatever has the most arcane, I guess. Cruel fate, sure. Um, we have favorites. Malachi, the Zem, Rufus. <laughs> I'm not good with these. Tomato man. Uh, Rockman should be his own thing. Is there a randomizer in this? Rockman's burly. That's very burly, apparently. Um, get the Bloodborne fix here. Uh, these details. These presets. Let's start. That's a Brockman. That's a Brockman if ever I saw one. <gasps> a chin. A proud, noble chin. Yep. I think pretty much perfect. Beautiful. His nose is... <laughs> the top of his nose protrudes out and then goes back in and then comes back out again before... Oh, hello. Inbred. <laughs> Proud inbred king. Yes. Something, something. French aristocracy. Right. Fantastic. Let's go. Now I do have to pick things up. <laughs> I know where the hunter's torch is, so that's going to help. Um, that is in Old Yarnum. Um, yeah, maybe we could focus on doing like a kind of build with... Uh, as a no-no word. It, it was apparently bullying. <laughs> so... <laughs> even though it began with the word proud. Okay. Place your bets. Good. Will I beat... Werewolf, empty-handed. I'm gonna try. <gasps> um, oc Octanian. No, that is a good bet. Uh, how do I double? Yeah, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm double-handing. Making weapons elemental makes them scale with arcane, so that's an option too. True, but that is almost always a bad proposition. Hi. No. No. This was correct! <laughs> I have beaten him with barehanded before. Takes a while. Uh, rely on viscerals. They gotta die anyway. <clears throat> or use the lantern. Either way. What do I win? Uh, you win a uh, weekend's holiday whenever your work permits it. Um, right. What can we do? Uh, none of these really scale with arcane, so I'll just do Soul Cleaver. Now, I should do axe to get used to slow attacks, right? Also, I don't think I've ever used the axe. Let's use the axe. Um, I prefer the pistol than the blunderbuss. Oh, yeah, I can't get in yet. Notebook, cheers. Closed. Plop! <gasps> Kingly carrot. Sweet. I look forward to my prize in May. Oh. <laughs> Oh, now I feel bad. Um, okay, cool. Let's get cracking. An hour and a half into the stream, we have begun the playthrough. <laughs> Which, to be fair, I've watched people... I was about to say I've watched people spend that long in character creators. Dark is in the chat. 
Um, <clears throat> Hi, Doc. <laughs> You hearing the audio getting crackly? Or is that just me? I might just... No, no, that, that would be you as well. This used to happen, didn't it? I feel seen. Because <laughs> you are. That's not the button. Hi. Thanks. <laughs> it's easier with an axe, turns out. I'll tell you how long you've been rotating furniture in this one build for. But that is the game, that's the difference. Yeah, I think the audio's crackly again. Hang on, this happens occasionally. Uh, actually, you'll continue seeing the game, won't you? I won't. I can't see what's good, unless I play through OBS. It does go flickery for a second. One moment, please, it says on my screen. There we go. Everybody stretch! Don't sit down for too long. Hydrate. Facing rotation mechanics in Animal Crossing is frustrating. Hi. Oh, why? Oh, why? You plague ridden rat! Look at that damage! We're doing damage! <laughs> My word. Uh, to be fair, you've seen people that uh, that long just making a face in character creators. Particularly in Dark Souls ones, that always seems weird to me because you never see your character's face. <laughs> like, here's, here's Brockman. There he is. Actually, I used to have a friend who looked a bit like him. Um, lamp. Teleport to the Hunter's Dream. Pebbles! Their eyes, you know. My axe is better than yours. Right. Uh, there's no point going that way. Let's go this way. This chance finished! This chance finished! Oh, yeah. Uh... Music down. Wait. You're wearing a face revealing headwear and forget what you look like. Uh, you're embarrassed. How long? Okay. Took you to realize Mr. Talking about Animal Crossing whenever he said she was rotating furniture. Uh, I don't have a lot of health. I should probably pay attention to that. That's a death. Um, I forgot I didn't have health. I was <laughs> used to the previous playthrough where we were just like had so much health and defense. Oh dear. Um, also, I went with uh, the build that has no vitality, so. <laughs> just took it at face value. Hey, look, this might just enjoy a bit of furniture right there. What's the thing? That's the thing. Come here, you. I've never done this before. Spin to win! <laughs> Very satisfying. I am Gascoigne now. You've been munched by Rosie! Yum! Why am I not swinging horizontally? Spin to win! This turn's finished! Now ah, Molotovs. Where are my things? I don't hear it. Karina kept calling it rotating furniture and she's not wrong. Hi. This is a pretty satisfying weapon. Hang on, does the tentacle transform? I didn't even try. Does it have a transformation attack? Where are 
are my echoes? Who got them? Someone over here? Who has my echoes? Oh no! Look at that animation throttling. Gotta love it. There we go, got him. Thought it might be one of them. <laughs> Bad out of stamina. Always bad. Blood vial. Yeah, we're gonna have to start worrying about that as well now, aren't we? Using up blood vials and stuff. Would you call me? Grumpy glasses. Turn up. Quick silver boulet. This turn's finished. This turn's finished. Also, the dodge is much faster. Oh, I thought that was important. Cold blood dew. That was another thing I did on my first playthrough. I didn't use any of the consumable <laughs> soul things because I didn't know what they were. <laughs> Kept picking them up. So what is this thing? I don't know. Seems complicated. Uh, this is a torch, isn't it? Oh, hi. It's your fault. It's my fault? What? What did I do? Found these guys a few times, blood vials. <laughs> nice. Torch! Torchio! Uh. Does scale with arcane. Also does crap damage. But we've got it! Um, it's not the hunter's torch, but it's a torch. It is an torche. Um. This way. Screw going up the bridge, let's go this way. Smashy smashy. Hello doggy. Alright then. Only technical has a transformation attack if you barrel L1 during any attack. Cool. I just didn't bother checking for some reason. <laughs> I never used the transform stuff. Actually, I do with the sword cleaver. It's pretty good with the sword cleaver. Works well in a combo. Uh, let's try it in a combo here. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I should specify for people who don't know, every weapon in this game has two forms. Um, so the axe has short form, one hand, or long form, two hands, during which you can't use the gun. Ah, horizontal is the gun button, okay. Um, it becomes dual wield. Dual wield tentacle. <laughs> also known as a dwentacle. Um, yeah, I can't remember where anything is in this, so I'm just gonna have to sort of try and pick everything up. Oop. Pungent blood cocktails, lovely. Yum yum. Hey kids, don't forget your pungent blood cocktails when you go to school. The pack lunch is not complete without them. Yeah, that's what I want. That's what I want for crowd control. Oop. I should have reached. You play grin and rat! Hopefully the volume's a bit better now. I'm gonna have to come up with some 69. I'm gonna have to come up with some uh, game appropriate vegetables for these streams. 
pretty sure there's some stuff up here that's useful. Don't know where it is. Here. Nice. Excuse me. Good to know. Big nose carrot. Upgrade materials. You are adamant, aren't you? Stand and deliver. Your money or your life. I don't know why I turned him into a cockney there. Huh? That's terrifying. Oh no, it works. Okay. Oh no, this this game requires like 700 upgrade materials to upgrade anything, isn't it? It's got a little bit. Hey, you keep missing our first. <laughs> It is a curse that will be passed from person to person. Nice! You plague ridden rat! Oh, you're not dead. Oh, hi, I've gone at you. I literally just moved through you. That's better. Don't fall down, I need your stuff. Thank you. Right, better hunter set. Um, I think you can survive this fall, but I don't know how, so let's go around. Hello, rats. Ow. Goodbye, rats. So what's everybody up to for the rest of the week, eh? Look always makes you think of Brotherhood of the Wolf. I always like I like the torn tricorn. It's a good look. Signature hat for the game. Hey, we were just down there. Look at that. Oh. Twisty turny level design, isn't it marvelous? Isn't it? Lots of drawing. Make sure you rest. Frequently. Where am I going? Uh, okay, we're doing cleric beast apparently. No, not we're dead. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> um, are you just watching a video on the tentacle move set? You didn't realize the explosion move was just its R two. Oh, that must be the transformed one. I've been doing the R two quite a lot. It's just a really slow build up for me. Yeah, maybe I should try that out. <laughs> Explosion move sounds good. Probably not. Without Arcane, anyway. This is supposed to be a quick run-through. <laughs> so that we can try and get to the DLC to get the weapon to start a new game. I don't know where my echoes are. Any of you have them? Doesn't look like it. Stained and deliver your money or your life. <laughs> Lots of laundry and moving stuff around too because your brother got a bookcase. Some of the piles of books. Oh, well, that's something <laughs> at least. <laughs> Gotta make space to build it. It's always an inconvenience. Alright, okay. 
Take two. Made it. Not a lot more damage, to be honest. At least it's quick. Come on, do something. You're very sedentary in your first phase, aren't you? Yeah, you can just miss all your attacks, that's fine. Funny you to have this one, shouldn't you? Additional reach will be handy. Thirteen damage. Occasionally, this really does bugger all. Um, no, 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 boom. I think it was the moveset that's really just getting me down. It's just so slow. It's not like I'm doing amazingly now. But I've just... So far, I haven't been getting in. So far, he says. <laughs> Can you lock onto the torso? I have the idea. And look, I've already broken a limb. I mean, it's New Game Plus, obviously. It's going to be different, but... There we go, got him. Visceral. Cantrip. Yeah, that, that stab attack is not great. By the way, the kind of point of the mechanic of this game is that you see this, die, and then go back and have a look. Because now you can do that. Um, so I'm not... It's not that I'm not supposed to be able to do this. <laughs> I'm not going to feel bad if I... Ah. 
Punch, punch. Business snap. Got a lot today. Right? That's a lot better damage <laughs> than the similar attack I was using with the transformation form. Oh, that's not very good at all. The snip is real buzzers. with a gun sword hunter badge fun fact if you don't kill the boss there on your first playthrough you don't get the sword hunter badge <clears throat> which means that you can't buy antidotes that would have made my first playthrough a lot nicer <laughs> getting poisoned all the time blood stuff makes it even worse hello hi um i guess i'm here to level arcane? There's a little face carrot. Bit of vitality, I guess. Antidotes? Uh, there's no point leveling up the thing, because. I don't know how long I'm going to be using it for. Uh. Oh, torpedo. Little colon torpedo. Uh, I will buy one blood vessel. Thank you. Blood vial. Blood vial. Uh. Can we get a level out of that. Welcome. What? Very well. Sure. We've almost got as much arcane as I did oh, in the well, previous playthrough. <laughs> After an entire game of playing. Um, I don't know why I went to the bridge. There's no reason not to, I guess. Um, uh, uh, you want to work on the colors for the star sketch and something else this week? Sorry, you've been keeping you waiting. No, it's no waitings. It's, it's everybody takes however much time. I was talking, uh, talking about this before. Um, I think I might have just been talking to Chibi or someone that uh, I I like trying to combine ideas and see where they go. And I had this idea to do a kind of friend draw thing, but also a draw in this style, but also telephone. Um, <laughs> so what you do is you, you draw a character, one of your characters or whatever, or just aim, make up a character, do whatever you want. And then everybody passes their character to the next person who then draws that character in their style. And then they pass what they've drawn to the next person who draws that in their style, etc, etc. And then you see how the character changes and transforms. Um, I thought that might be fun. Um, but I also don't know how long it's going to take. <laughs> if every individual stage relies on the previous stage having been completed, you know. Yes, I'm a hunter, but I don't know of anywhere safe to go. I need to f fight Danny Gascoigne. First, however, important business. Oh, come on, Eileen. Oh, a hunter, are you? And an outsider? What? Sorry, we, we, we heard this dialogue earlier, so... Shake off cape. What? Yeah, hunter must hunt. Actually, we need to hear that. 
What are you still doing here? Enough trembling in your boots. A hunter must hunt. Nice. I saw the voice actress saying that in real life and it's delightful. <laughs> Made me very happy. Hello, sir! A nice animation. <laughs> oh god, there's rats here. Rats in the sewers! Unthinkable. Ooh, sunbathing. Nice. Give me my health back. Thank you. Uh, that would be, well, you wouldn't say impossible because you proved not with Vive, but pretty dang interesting with you just doing realistic portraits of everyone. Yeah, that'll be part of the fun. Your, your style would inform how the next person interprets the character. Uh, ladder. Ladder? No ladder. Hello, everybody! Thanks. <laughs> that was fun. Should have upgraded the axe while I was there. Oh, no, no, I said I wouldn't do that because there was no point. No upgrades! Hello, Peg. Blood vials. We turn into Gartic chaos. So that's that's what was made, making me think about it when we were doing Gartic. Thinking if you could do a draw this in your style, but with Gartic's sort of sensibilities. Wouldn't it be nice? Oh, you didn't die. They did. <laughs> Evidently, the boulder does not scale with new game. Thank you. Where is the daughter? I guess it doesn't matter. Ah, excuse me. I have no need of your wares. Oh. Give me that health back. Blood vials. Where did his body go? I wasn't paying attention. Well then. Now that song stuck in your head, I can't even remember what I was referring to. Hello, Daddy Gascoigne! Yep. <laughs> in we go! Hi, I fought you already. It went well. See how it goes now that I have the same weapon. Oh, 
was not paying attention. Do you, do you, Zidane does more damage now. <laughs> I've got to actually start thinking about it. Oh, I've got to actually do this like a proper fight now. An unupgraded weapon as well. <laughs> I'll parry that. Oops, thought I was far away enough for that. Apparently, he just rips the cobblestones out from underneath your feet when with that attack. Oh, come on, surely that's a parry. Parries are a lot less generous than I thought in this game. when it's transformed is not good. What's that smell? The sweet blood. Oh, it seems to me. It's enough to make a man sick. Dodge back, what are you doing? Never dodge back in Blood Bowl. Silly idea. Well, missed that opportunity. Oh yeah, can shoot afterwards, okay. Oh, yeah, here we go. Stuck on the lamp post! Get away from the kick! Never dodge backwards, what are you doing? Keep dodging backwards. <laughs> Got up to the smell of broccoli from blood! They're very irony. Okay. Here we go again. Apparently I'm just not good at the fight. <laughs> uh, why, why am I in? Yeah. I'm just trying to work out the best way from here. Oh yeah, there's the thing. Thanks. Oh, I don't have any blood vars. Oh, God. Back on this, are we? Yeah, saw that coming. It's Bloodborne, everybody! Where heals are limited and you have to pay for them. farm blood vials <laughs> this is why I would do this off stream <laughs> I 
Well, let's go back and see if I can make my weapon better at the very least. Yes, I know it's going to be a waste of blood shards, but... Quit your complaining hoonta and get on <laughs> with it. But a hoonta must hoont! I can get two. Uh. Yeah, let's level this up. I'll probably be using it a decent amount. Diamond slips and blued. Okay, right. Let's do a little bit of farming, then we'll do Gascoin. These, I'll, I'll do these streams for longer, because if we're going to be playing this game twice, we're going to have to get through it. I'll do farming off stream so you don't have to worry about all that stuff. Um, But I am going to need blood, vessel, blood, blood vials for this fight. Because I'm not good. It makes you in the mood to save your strobs as soon as there's zero chance of frost. Strobs! Get your strobs, everybody! Fine. This turn's finished! This turn's finished! Blood vials. Okay, that should be enough. Doing a bit more damage. Got pretty much full blood vials. Might be able to get one from the enemy just before. Send that back up. I think coins usually. Oh, blood vials, wonderful. Ow, oh, come on. Yeah, screw you. Yeah, absolute bugger. Oh, come on.
No, there we go. Bye. Give me a little break. Right. I'm a bit wet. I've ever backstabbed it before. <laughs> That's a new one. You're confused by that, aren't you? That's all you gotta do. Oh dear. It's panic. Panic is the thing. And you're like, oh god no, what am I doing? Ah! Let's just do it. Do it properly. Get over the panic. Get it done. Still have no idea how to do phase one properly. People, people play this game without getting hit. <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> how does that work? These people are weird. There's a shoe. That's not a vegetable. Blood gem workshop tool. Oh yeah. Right, come on, speedrun. Thank you. <laughs> Got there eventually. Uh, sure. Back to the hunter's dream. A hunter must hunt. Fishing in Animal Crossing. That's what I, I think I had fishing in mind when I don't sit down. Let the echoes become your strength. Bloody motion controls. <laughs> okay, we now have as much arcane as we did in the previous playthrough. Um, can I only buy one? I can only buy. One. Okay. No bullet. I don't have much bullets. Grinding is for off stream. I can get a bunch of shards, which I'll probably need to upgrade things that are actually good at arcane. If I'm going to do arcane, it might be worth doing the flame sprayer or the rosemarinus, because that is pretty good with arcane. No, that's blood tinge. Oh, fuck. <laughs> get confused. I don't know these things. I'm bad. Uh, there's something I'm settling about the speed your villager goes from asleep to jumping awake in AC. Yeah, that's that's not me. <laughs> But well, it depends. In the winter, it's definitely not me. In the summer? Oh, yeah. Pizzoodle. Uh, we won't save the old lady because she'll just end up going mad. Um, and that's not fun. She's probably better off in her house. Anyway, here's the void. Void. But we've got a top hat, so that's the important bit. Um, hello! Hello! Excuse me. Thank you. There's the monocular over there. I don't need it. Oh, what a little. Three bloodstone shards. Five bloodstone shards. Whatever this is down here. Fun fact, this is the door next to the cleric beast. It doesn't open. Somebody finally got it modded recently <laughs> so that it did open and it goes exactly there. So it is actually the door. It feels like it should be because the cleric beast boss arena is just down over there. This is where the cleric beast is ostensibly jumping from. <laughs> Um, but yeah. Don't need the monocular, don't need What are you doing? 
I'm nowhere near you. Almond man. Hello, everybody. Can you can you tell me when the church service is? Well, let's all manned. Ukulele. But yes, the uh, the the amygdala is uh, based on a. Well, it's based on a couple of things actually. It's based on a plant. It's based on a nut, but also the amygdala, which is an almond-shaped part of the brain. Amygdala comes from the Latin for almond. I love the names of things in the brain because they really are just named. Well, this is this kind of shape, you know. Got the hippocampus, looks a bit like seals. You know, got the amygdala, looks like an almond. It's got the pineal gland because it looks like a pine cone. Makes the happy juice. It also comes from Star Wars amygdala, yes. Hello, friend. Evil seller. I knew it. With much chops. That's precisely how I started out. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Cooperate. Oh, take this. Fire paper. Yes. Take this. Okay. Bye. Pull the lever. Don't forget to pull the lever. That's how you get down to old Yarnum. Madman's knowledge. Hi, how you doing? Bye. Ooh. Hi again. <laughs> oh, there's something here. What's this? More madmen's knowledge! Does he have a reverse beard? He has mutton chops. Don't bring blood gems, though. We should probably do something with gems before we fight Bloodstarved Beast, but then again, Bloodstarved Beast is pretty simple. Once you know how to do it, Surprisingly, so so angry. My first playthrough with that boss. Turns out it's just eminently cheesable. Hopefully, I can remember how to do it. PCL is negative. You're not pregnant with a COVID. Hooray! I mean, hooray in one sense, and hooray in the other sense that you have to go to work now. <laughs> but I'm glad you don't have it. Yay! Happy not pregnant. <laughs> Happy not prick. Yeah, yeah. Hunters are not wanted here. Hunter! Turn back! You there. there, Hunter! Didn't you see the warning? Sorry, are you doing a thing? I'm, I'm, I need to kill this thing. I need the stone shards. <laughs> Thank you for your considerations, though. Right. Where's that torch? Hi. Yes, from the way you have a friend. Remember! Fighting two enemies at the same time in any game like this is always more than twice as difficult as fighting just one of them. Um... Hunter's Torch. Nice. Is this actually any good? <laughs> oh, B-scaling with Arcane. That's actually not bad. That does better damage now than the Cost Parasite did when I first got it. <laughs> sure. We have Hand Torch. Yeah. Nice. Uh, we can't do anything with this yet. Ow, ow. <laughs> Thought that was higher than it was. But yes, I am glad you are not Brigante.
Aregurinant. Pergantate. Pregnauts. <laughs> that is a gem of a video, isn't it? <laughs> Hi, sir. Nice. Pregnaut sounds like a weird, like, Transformers style thing. It's the Pregnauts! put antidotes on my bar, shouldn't I? Ah, oh, I missed it. Ah, October. I need to, I need to, I thought 60 would be enough. <laughs> that was Sir Rabbit. Uh, half drunk with blood. You are a skilled hunter. Adapt. A half cut, sorry. Half cut with blood, as the best hunters are. Which is why I must stop. Stop with things! You know, the hurting me stuff. Not very pleasant. Very unkind of you. I was a little bit dry in there. Yeah, that'll do. Gotcha. It's not as good as the broccoli headbutt, but, uh... Oh, you're quick, quick little boy, aren't ya? Uh, yeah. Which is why I must stop you. Tentente! Oh, I missed it. Excuse me, can you tell me the way to the public library? No, oh, okay. Hi. Moustache! Moustaches! Half cut with blood. Which is why I must stop. Oh yeah, I forgot about the gun. Literally the whole gimmick of the area. Bye! <laughs> There's a hunter there, I can kill you later, that's fine. Right, let's take care of Jura. Now, if you don't do this right, this is a tough fight. Well, let's see if we can do it. Oops. <laughs> Try and get the ladder first. It's hard enough just getting there. Alright. Give me a lot of trouble on my first playthrough. Should, uh... You've got red on you. Yeah, I do. Ah, right. Colin, Japan Studio from Software. Comes Blood Bonnet. <gasps> the amygdala's back.
It's a red sheen. There we go. Powder keg hunter badge. I don't know if I'm going to need anything from that, but I might as well get it. Everything's on fire. If only we had somebody to blame for that. Always annoyed me how empty this bit is. <laughs> Look at it, it's just... There should be something there, a couple of statues or whatever. most important item. Hi! Hey oh. <laughs> We both had the same idea. <laughs> Funny that. Run out of assets. Have you seen how many times they copy and paste <laughs> statues on this game? <laughs> We're about to enter an area like that now. Actually, we're not. I'm going to open a shortcut and kill a hunter by making him jump off a ladder. Look at that booty shake. Shake the booty. Shake the booty. Mr. Brockman, shake the booty. <gasps> Hollow snip. Excuse me, may I have your attention? I think I have your attention. Did you just walk in the fire? Second thing to do. Caesar salad. Thank you. Uh, there is stuff down here I should probably get. Ow! Bloody crows! Sorry, Eileen. You're the only good one. Actually, that's not true. There's two good ones. Don't know how to use belts, do we not? Oh yeah, we've got a bit of a, a Nomura thing going on here. <laughs> mine! Also mine. Mine? More like mine! Could be dead here, depending on this, how this turns out. Uh, I missed the rifle, but I don't really care about it. Um, not gonna be using it. Do you not like ladders either? No. Six but oh that was from the hunter, I was gonna say. <laughs> Six bone marrow ash, what are you talking about? Six bone marrow ash From the back when we climb stairs it looks stupid. Yeah. Come hither, you No, attack him. Nope, that's dead. <laughs> 
But I killed the thing, that's what matters. <laughs> it's both alive vials. It doesn't explain the four underneath it. <laughs> I don't know, maybe we lost the buttons on our waistcoat or something, but still. It's cheaper to get a new button than to get three more belts. You know? Got a lot of lot of beltage going on there. Fashion. That's one thing you can call it. I don't have much in the way of a bullet. Oh, I was looking at the architecture, how dare you? Down we go! Wee! There's nobody here. Just a ladder. And a human being. Oh, something died. <laughs> something tried to follow me. Is it worth trying to do it again? Where did it go? Oh, uh, it's gone. It's fine. I probably don't need it anyway. He says needing it. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Jump scare! Do it again, I forgot to jump. <laughs> Alas, it is a one-time thing. Hi! You sure about that? That does not seem on brand. Um... And you do. Don't mind if I don't. I think there's some pungent mud cocktails back there. I don't know what that is, so probably not important. I know what you are, though. <whistles> Ding! Well, rude of this version of Animal Crossing. Yeah. I was about to say, can you imagine a combination of Animal Crossing and the yeah? I literally did it. But we, we talked about it this stream, didn't we? <laughs> nice, thanks. Cold blood dev. Everyone has a bullet made it spoopy. She's always been spoopy, you just never saw her though. Right, BSB. How you doing, friend? It's been a while. Wow. To the main place, the ideal. Keep 
Put it into that. Look at that fine paper. Get out of the pillar, please. Thank you. Okay, fantastic. I I had an antidote, didn't I? Probably got hit just after I used it. Oh, that's annoying. The night of tanning, doing business, and being October. Nice. And dying to bosses. That should be easy. Oh wait, I haven't actually put in any gems in my weapon. I should probably do that. That may help a little. Uh, let's do, do that very quickly. And then we'll go back. Say hello to Busba, Busby. Good old Busby. Actually, how much damage am I doing? I'm wondering whether it's worth using that torch. <laughs> Blood gem fortification. Oh, I can't fortify that. Is it worth fortifying this? I need souls, but I have soul. So these are for. Also, while I'm here. Sorry, little girl, you're gonna survive. Um. If this is indeed worth having a go. Okay. Can't fortify. Oh, no. No. Okay. Oh, that's alright. Um. Oh, this does bugger all anyway. Sure. We'll go with it. Um. Boy, isn't this a thrilling stream? This non broccoli broccoli run. Okay, quick vote. Would you be interested in watching the rest of this playthrough to get to the broccoli? Or would you prefer me to do that off stream? Because we will be doing the entire 
game as broccoli. It's just I want to get to the point where I can actually use the broccoli properly. Broccoli properly? Hopefully. Oh no, it's uh, blood pellets, isn't it? Blood dark pellets. Yeast pellets. Yeast blood pellets, that's the one. <laughs> Got there in the end. <clears throat> Couple of hundred iterations, you eventually get them. Back to the chapel. The old church in old Yarnum. Looks pretty. Get out the wall. Oop. One of us got turned around there. Oh no, the slow poison just immediately came back. Um, not fast if it bothers you, then do off stream broccoli get. It just feels like playing the game through twice. It's, the broccoli playthrough is going to lose its impact, you know? <laughs> also, this isn't going very well at all. <laughs> I'm very out of practice. <laughs> Then you still have more of my free time. I mean, I'll be playing Bloodborne. It's not. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> I'm just annoyed this is taking this long. Come on. I got to the point where I trivialized this boss, and here I am dying to it. How dare I? With an unfamiliar weapon, having not played the game for two years. What do I think I am? Mortal? Fallible? Human and thus to err? Never. I am inf infallible. What on earth are you doing? <laughs> Fuck her off. Got enough trouble without you getting involved. <laughs> Alright, well, that's one less heal. Um. Okay. Less cheese. Is that bloody poison? Now, yeah, imagine doing a playthrough of this where the poison is constantly killing you and you can't get more antidotes. <laughs> That was my first playthrough. Can you tell why I didn't like this boss? <laughs> but you went to play fetch. Then why was he running towards me?
Get out of that. into the main building, please. wrong button. What are you doing? What? Yep, okay, good. Yep. Well, apparently the pungent blood cocktail just didn't want to work. Um, <laughs> can't even use the cheese mechanics. They just fail. Yeah, this might require some off-screen grinding because I'm just running out of antidotes and vials and... Ah, oh, dear. Honestly. This is not how I wanted the stream to go. Yeah, we've got two antidotes left. We've got three more cocktails. I might be able to do it. Uh, let's also rearrange these in a way that's going to actually be conducive to not dying. Um, we can do it! Positivity. I mean, I can do it. That's the problem. The problem is I can do it, and I'm not. da ba da, -da. This stream should have ended 40 minutes ago, but I've carried on and not done anything of value. Da, 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 da. I'm just being very rude. That's very rude of me. I can avoid this boss altogether by just saving up some money. Kill it with fire. I'm trying. <laughs> oh, apparently I didn't pick up my button. It goes from last time. Oh, I think it happened. Was using this. 
get better reach, more likely to hit. Does make you go a little bit faster? Yeah. Actually hitting the boss, turns out, might be helpful. Oh yeah, hang on, I was going to check, wasn't I? That's pretty good. That's better than my weapon. <laughs> Short range, but... Kill it with fire, apparently. So yeah, the idea of the Pungent Blood Cocktail, I probably should have explained this in the previous episode, um, is beasts, if you throw a Pungent Blood Cocktail, it's pungent and it's blood, uh, which means the beasts really want to go after it, and they will go after it at the expense of just ignoring you. Um, and so what you can do is you can just sort of throw this at a wall, and it'll go, ah, chase that, and leave you alone. Um, or better yet, just, you know, attack a wall for a bit, while you... Uh, Hit it in the backside. Yep, yeah, that's enough. Any problem with this? I don't get any rally. Quick moves, though. Man. Last of my antidotes. Did this boss really have to be poison? I'm not entirely sure what gameplay advantage you could possibly have. Yeah, for this phase, the torch is not ideal. Oh, okay, well done. Yeah. Deal with it. Heal the poison. <laughs> oh dear. My word. Oh look, three antidotes. What about them? Um. Right, Hunter's Dream. Let's see what we can do. Uh, we can get to the under thing now. Let's open up the way to Amelia. Cool. Feeling cool. Welcome home, good hunter. Mm -hmm. Some health would be lovely. Blood oh, I missed it. Bugger! <laughs> I need to make them stay on screen a bit longer. <laughs> uh, what can I buy with 11 insight? Insight is only going to screw me over later on. 
Oh, I could buy pungent blood cocktail. Uh, Gascoigne set. Ashen set. It was Colin. Cool, right, back to Cathedral. Back to Cathedral Ward. Yes, I have a little route that I'm going to do. Do it real quickly. How long am I going to go for today? I'm just going to open up the way to Amelia and then be done. Um... So yeah, if you want to leave now, nothing interesting is going to happen. Uh, we just need to go down here. This door mysteriously opens when we kill the Bloodstar Beast. Let's grab this one a bit. Formless Urn. Messenger Urn Festival. Very important. Actually, this is a bit more involved than I remember. Might go to the workshop and just stop there. I feel I should have been smashed. Probably, yeah. Amelia, we came this far? Yeah, no, that's going to need some explaining, I'm afraid. <laughs> I need your bullets. Okay, yeah, I'll do, I'll I'll get down to the um the abandoned workshop. Then I'll stop there. Communion. Yeah, not getting rally is annoying, but it's not the end of the world. Doing more damage than the axe. It was to the Bloodstar Beast, but the Bloodstar Beast is uh, lacking in fire defense. Plop. Yeah, that's my face throughout the entire boss fight. <laughs> Let's have a look. Um, need a suitable test. Eighty-nine, hundred and seventy-three. Um, I'm assuming that's cumulative. Eighty-four. 167. What's <laughs> it? No, it's not. Wheelchair gun guy's awesome. They've got a like, massive Gatling guns on a wheelchair, it's great. Bye. Ow! You do a lot of damage. You might kill me. Oh dear. He's still alive. Screw you. I thought it was an item. Is 
Love it when the violence is considered. Excuse me, do you mind if I just whap you over the head with an axe? No, jolly good. This is rather in my intentions as a hunter, you see. Landed that fall in the wheelchair. Oh no, it was the non-wheelchair guy that landed. I think I killed the wheelchair guy. Flame sprayer! Yep. Look, silver boulet. Oh, another flame spray. Oh, oh, that's death. Okay. <laughs> I didn't even need to go up here. I just wanted the badge. I don't even know why I wanted the badge. I don't know what it gives. <laughs> okay. Beeline to the thing. Screw details. Fire hot. I'm, I'm reliably informed that it is. I'm also unreliably informed that it is, which is how you know uh, that it's correct. Oh, bugger. Flame Sprayer does silly damage with Arcane. That's what I was thinking. Oh, and the Flame Sprayer is just before Amelia, isn't it? So we'll see. We'll see what we can do. That might be the way we go with this. Right. Beelining straight for the workshop. <laughs> Let's go. I don't know why I'm why I'm doing this. That's all I'm gonna get at well I, I guess I get money at the workshop. I sell the doll set. But I don't need the umbilical cord because on this playthrough I'm just not gonna bother fighting the moon presence. You can survive that with beautiful. Ooh. Let's try it again! Whee. My zero echoes, thank you so much. Be a little more careful this time. Nice. I mean, bloody age is my first playthrough, just get that right. <laughs> Welcome to the abandoned workshop. Very pretty. Doll set. Old hunter bone. Third umbilical cord. And... Small hair on. I don't have the monocular, so we can't see the doll's finger twitch. Reduces full damage and it's got a drop attack that eliminates full damage too. Nice. Nice. Uh, do you want the hair ornament? What? What is this? Oh no, I'm crying. Thank you. Oops. Boom. I can't remember what it's good. Probably something not particularly good. Um. HP continues to recover. Yeah, not exactly. Thrilling. Uh, okay. We'll leave it there. It's been three hours. <laughs> Nothing has happened. Uh, if I get any time off stream, which I won't because it's tomorrow, uh, <laughs> I plan on doing. I'll do some chalice dungeon stuff, get a bunch of levels, see what we can do, get some farm for blood vials and bullets and stuff. I'll do it in between streams. It's fine. Not in between these two streams, but thenceforth, just do a little bit in the morning <laughs> every day. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so this is this is the non, this is the the path to Brock. This is the the pre-Brock, the anti-Brock, the uh, 
and I... <laughs> I think that's the one advantage of the DSS with SS. Yeah, the, the... Like, it would be nice if you had, like, a minimum for blood vials, and then you could stock more. But whatever. Uh, yeah, so we're, we're working our way. It's going to be a while until we get Brock again. But hopefully <laughs> this time when we do get it, I will do not awful damage. Ah, oh dear, I don't know. Um, well, thank you for coming along to this rather shoddy stream, all things considered. Um, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with more of this. Uh, do, 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 boom, there we go. Um, turns out Bloodborne is an anagram of Blonde Boo. Um, the transformed attacks are cool with the tentacles big reach that's uh, i'm hoping uh, once we actually do some damage with it we might not do a lot of damage but we'll do some damage um yeah apologies if i came across a little annoyed i i don't like it when plans don't go <laughs> as expected like i say if i was doing this on my own i'd be fine but it's because I'm streaming and in the back of my mind, I'm like, oh, God, I'm, this is boring. People came here for a good time and this is awful. Ah. Um. You're fine. I'm not fine. That's the problem. I should be, but I'm not. Anyway. We'll work. This is the path to Brock. We will we will continue the path to Brock tomorrow. Um, yeah, thank you for coming along. I hope you enjoyed whatever this was. <laughs> this is me just getting flustered, um, frustrated. Parsnip, darling friend, we would not be here if you were boring us. Stop being mean to yourself, you absolute gem of a vegetable. This little lad of mine. Um, but you would. That's the problem with friends, is that they're nice. Um, <laughs> what Miss and Hazel said. Honestly, Hazel's just always copying what Miss says. Terrible. Um, yeah, back tomorrow. Get wrecked, bitch. Um, I feel like, yeah, if we can get the flame sprayer up and running. I reckon we can make this playthrough feel different to the first one. <laughs> Come down there and find me. I think that's the other thing is like in my mind, I'm like, original content. Let's not do something we've done before. And we're doing something we've done before. <laughs> um, he dresses vicarious of on screen outside my window. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> yeah, and all the magics, yeah, call beyond. It'd be great. Um, cool. Thank you for coming along. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> I don't doubt you will. Um, yeah. Have a good, have a good, everybody. Thank you for being lovely. Um, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow with stuff, with Bloodborne. And then Saturday will be the start of the Bioshock Infinite draw through. Um, enjoy me drawing things that will immediately be covered up by a redacted sign um yeah go rest you go rest i need a shower have a good time everybody enjoy yourselves have a lovely week if i don't see you or talk to you uh before the week is over i hope it's a lovely one and if not uh i hope the very much shorter period of time between now and then is lovely and then the bit afterwards as well but i can wish you that at the time um yeah bye